According to a report from Us Weekly, Ben Affleck may not be reprising his role as Batman in the upcoming DC Universe flick. A new report claimed Ben would not be returning as the Kate Crusader for the next installment of the franchise. On 30 January, Deadline reported that the actor would be replaced in The Batman, set for release on 25 June, 2021. Matt Reeves, the writer, and director, supposedly wants to take the movie in a younger direction and needs someone from the new generation of actors. On Wednesday, the 46-year-old tweeted his support for the movie, stating that he was excited to see the next Batman production. The actor wrote that he was looking forward to seeing Matt Reeves's vision come to life. Moreover, Deadline's report wrote that Ben was passing the torch to the next line of entertainers. Initially, Ben was supposed to be the film's writer and director, but he backed off from that position when Matt took over in February 2017. Deadline claims Matt is currently looking to find a replacement for the Good Will Hunting alum. In 2016, Affleck first started portraying Bruce Wayne in the movie, Batman vs. Superman, Dawn of Justice. He went on to play the superhero in 2016's Suicide Squad as well as 2017's Justice League. These days, Ben has been in the media for a number of different reasons. This past summer, Ben opened up about his alcohol abuse, following his stay at a rehabilitation clinic in August. It was right after he and his girlfriend of the time, Lindsay Shookus, broke up and he started dating a model half his age. In a statement on his Instagram in October, Ben wrote that battling any addiction is a lifelong and difficult struggle. Amid reports that his ex-wife was helping him get better, Ben said that he was fighting for not only himself but his family as well. This comes just four months after it was revealed that Henry Cavill would no longer portray Superman as well. The 35-year-old star, however, denied the report and shared an Instagram photo of himself holding his Superman action figure and also wearing his Krypton t-shirt. It appears as though the film studios intend to keep the comic book movies going for a long time yet.